Hello and welcome back to my channel and yes it has been quite a while since I put a video out uh, I have been on holidays for two uh, two weeks I have so when I came back I had oh, at least five boxes worth of steel books and items that I have to do videos for now so this will it will be about six videos this week I'll do one a day so today's the first one all the way to Sunday so the first one we're gonna do and it was the first stuff that my brother told me turned up at the house is the Film Vault collection. So we did get Shawshank Redemption and Jaws out in this one. And the first one we do is Shawshank Redemption because it is the fifth one in this set. And I have done videos for the previous four as well. If I can find the links, I'll put them in the description down below. But these are absolutely magnificent sets. And the artwork on these by Matt Ferguson and uh, Flowery for um, Vice Press is absolutely chef's kiss. Absolutely amazing artwork, as you can see on this one. So, without further ado, let's get on with it. So, first off, let's get the cover off. So, you get a nice little protective plastic cover. Nice little border to go around the picture, but there, vault number five, Shawshank Redemption, and then on the back end is what we get with all this. So there's all what we get, a bit of a write-up as well, and some of the special features we get with the 4K and Blu-ray. So it looks very beautiful. So we get the out the case first of all, and there we have Andy Dufresne after his free after he escapes right at the end. Absolutely. Like I said, stunning artwork, absolutely beautiful. They are, they look beautiful up on the shelf as well. So it is pretty much a wrap around on the sides, not so much on the back. There we have Andy Dufresne with his first, uh, when he first goes to the sh uh, Shawshank. It is nothing down below, all just black down below there, but we do get a nice little magnetic uh, seal on the side. So if I can open this up a little bit, show out a little bit more about everything falling out. So again, yeah, beautiful artwork. Love the trees, thunder in the by, uh, lightning in the background. It is, yeah, very good indeed. So let's open it up. So we do get, uh, remember red, hope is a good thing. Maybe the best of things and no good thing ever dies. And need to frame. And then you have one of the um, cell blocks from the Shaw, uh, Shawshank but there. And here's the tool he used to escape. Funny little joke in the movie. It is very nice little folder indeed. And again, Dear Warden, you were right. Salvation lay within. And he defines so a nice little, it looks like a nice little folder from the movie as well. So we open this up and pull out the contents. Let's put that to one side first. So let's do get a couple of posters, or is it one poster, sorry, and it is pretty much the same artwork as on the front. So again, absolutely stunning. They would look amazing up on the wall. If I had more room, they'd all be up on the wall. They would. We get a couple of art, a few art cards for you, so some of the main characters. Um, Andy Dufresne, Red, The Warden. Can't remember the names of most of these guys, but again... Very nice indeed. And on the back end, a few uh, quotes from the movie. So, yeah. Absolutely love this movie. Definitely in my top ten movies. Absolutely brilliant. Never gets old every time you watch it. And it's a long film as well. So, surprisingly, it is. And then, oh, we get a nice little touch here. It's... Uh... <laughs> The letter Andy uh, writes to Red. So, very nice indeed. Beautiful paper as well. Very thick, proper paper as well. And a nice little envelope with Red on it as well. So, that's a nice little touch to have in this. And I do like, actually, there is two posters. So, we get the original art poster. Well, poster you normally see with it. And then this was like when they redid it in uh, again. I think I've seen this artwork before. So again, another beautiful artwork for there for another poster. Too many posters and nowhere to put them, unfortunately. So let's have a look at some of the other. Let's do the little uh, 
glass ornament we get on the top of there. So I've got out of 5,000, even though it says it's only out of 4,000 on where I bought it, uh, 2,536. So not exactly a low number, but uh, unlike my other ones, because I had them as like a promotional thing, they, I got sent them to review. I didn't have numbers on it. So, so it's nice to have ones with uh, some numbers on it. And again, you got the little hammer by there. Shawshank then, so that's beautiful indeed. And then let's have a look at the remaining uh, goodies. So there it is, two five, uh, 245, which I'm guessing is Andy Frame's number for his prison. So again, very nice little card slip for there. Then, oh yes, the CDs, this is. I forgot about these. Uh, these have CDs in them. So a few scenes from the movie, but there as well. I think that's the scene when Andy's uh, playing the music, yeah. Not that scene, obviously. That's where he gets some beers on top of the roof. But I think this scene is where he's playing the music over the tannoy system. So here's the 4K and the Blu-ray in two different colours, which is nice to see. And not just blue and black. Just uh, white and uh, more of like a dark sandy colour. There it is. And then we have red... And Andy again with Red's uh, a little tag from well, something Red says, but there as well. So again, absolutely another cracking set, to be honest, from Vice Press. And I was a bit thing with the first lot because you got some cracking ones for the first one. Even 1917 was a good touch for it, but it was like, hmm, seemed a bit out of place, unfortunately, with the other classics. It is. I was in this. But this one has four pretty much main classics ones. I think Jaws is the next one video, which will be up tomorrow. And then down the line then is 2001 A Space Odyssey and uh, Apollo 13. That's it. It is. But an absolutely stunning set. It is. And I got. A f I think this one hasn't sold out yet over... over um, Zavi and I think the other ones. I think Jaws is the only one that really did sell out, which I expected from this set. But a great start uh, to the week of videos and a great start for the new Film Vault collection. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. Tell me down below what you think of this movie. Is it in your top 10? Don't you really, uh, do you like it or not? Or I personally think it was robbed at the Oscars. It should have won quite a lot. It should have cleaned up that year, in my opinion. And if you'd like to see more videos, I guess, please subscribe to my channel. And I will see you next time.